All right, guys, headed out for another adventure. This time I'm uh, headed to Colorado. I'm meeting up with uh, TJ Dillashaw. Um, he's actually one of our Fins and Feathers uh, pro staff celebrity members. So I'm trying to team up with the new el uh, elk outfitter for um, elk trips for Fins and Feathers for the next few years. And uh, we're gonna go out and see uh, Smith Rancho is the, is the outfitter. So TJ hunted with these guys last year, said there's tons of elk out there. He killed a nice bull. Um, I'm gonna go out there and, and check out the ranch. We're gonna hunt it for, I get there Friday night, tomorrow night. We're gonna hunt all day Saturday and come home Sunday. So real quick trip. Um, but there's a ton of elk out there, so hopefully we can get it done. I'm bringing my, my, the same gun I killed my other two elk this year with, my Weatherby. Um, it's the 300 Wind Mag um, with my Vorte Vortex Viper on it. I got all, all my stuff all packed. Um, I never really finish unpacking from <laughs> the other trips, but uh, it's just a quick glimpse at my game room. Those, those three bucks in the middle are Cali Blacktails I've killed here, two of them with my bow. That one was a rifle. It's a Utah mule deer. Utah mule deer. And then on the safe is a giant blacktail buck I got. Just a giant fork with eye guards. Couldn't couldn't resist. That's uh, my dream buck. I love those. And then that's a big uh, white tail I got in Ohio with my buddy Zach. Um, I think you guys have seen this buck. This is bodacious. This is uh, my Utah, my 2015 Utah muzzleloader. Ponsagant deer, just uh, 218 inches right there, but what an awesome buck. I think you guys have already seen this stuff, but anyway, so we got we got all this stuff ready, packed to go. Um, I'm, I'm gonna hit the hay, I think it's about 11 right now, but I don't, I don't fly out super early tomorrow, so I got some time to game plan in my mind, think stuff over, so we're gonna get this stuff all together, and uh, I'm crashing. All right guys, we are about to head to the airport. About to chug my morning Hulk load shake. This is a shake that I do pretty much every morning. Spinach, kale, um, we do Mountain Ops Whey. I put seeds, we got flaxseed, um, frozen fruit, banana, just a cool mixture of all kinds of stuff, but it's delicious. I'm gonna finish eating that and then uh, grab our stuff and we're headed to the airport. Colorado bound. My home away from home. That's what it's been feeling like the last few months, but it's all good. It's been traveling, living the dream. Uh, we have about an hour and a half flight, not bad at all. All right, we made it to Colorado. About to pick up our bags, and I think TJ's got to be close, so. We're gonna get this stuff and get after. We got about a three, three and a half hour drive to the ranch. So we got a bit of a, a trek, but not too bad. Just gonna get these things and get out of here. Uh oh. There's Killisha. <laughs> Let's do this. What's up, dude? Here. Chad, nice to meet you. What's up, dude? dude? Long time no see. How was the flight? I wasn't bad at all. That's good. It's pretty I quick, right? Most of it, yeah. Good. That's good. Did you leave in the morning? All right, guys. We just got picked up by Old Killershaw. We're uh, headed to. We're gonna head to your house. Yeah, head to my place. We're gonna go see uh, Joseph Benavidez. The Benavidez is in town, training for his fight. He's fighting December third. Looking like a killer right now. So we knew Chad was coming into town. He had to visit the happiest guy on planet. <laughs> <laughs> I haven't seen that guy in so long. I think it. I think his wedding was the last time I've seen him. Oh, no shit? Yeah. yeah. So it's been a while, so it'll be good to see this guy. Yeah. We've been in uh, Louisville. It's close to Boulder, Colorado. Nice. So it's on the way uh, to where we're hunting, out by Steamboat Springs and Craig. Nice. Right, so the place we're hunting is in Craig, right? Yes. So it's that, in between, yeah, it's like Craig pretty much. I don't think I've ever been there, but TJ actually hunted this spot last year, so he's been here, he's, he's done it, he says it's awesome. Tons of elk. We're super excited, so we're gonna get after it, go see Joe, and then we're hitting the road. All right, we just got to Dillashank's house. We're gonna pack all his stuff up, get all loaded up, and hit the road. Joe better hurry up. We're gonna leave him. He's, I think he's on his way, but he's always on Joe time, so we'll see him soon. Snail. Snail time, Snail, for sure. Slow. <laughs> yeah, sure. Oh, attack him. Hi. I got so many dogs. <laughs> Ha <laughs> ha!
I want to know where your bear's at, dude. Oh, my bear's in California. Ah. It's at my parents' house. This is the. Uh, TJ went, me and TJ went to Montana and killed. He killed a giant black bear. This Colored is my uncle's last year's property. I'll oh, check those out. Ah, oh, nice. Yeah. Last year's is what I got out there. It's awesome, dude. Yeah. Is that your first elk? My first elk ever. Dude, that's awesome. I went out there when they were uh, screaming, so that was always fun. You know, you yeah. call them in, and it's amazing, man. How many did you guys see last year, you think? I probably saw just six pointers alone. Probably a good eight of them. Nice. You know, I've probably seen a total of like 25 bulls, I bet. Okay, this you is going to be fun. Some little ones, some, some decent sized ones, some six pointers are wider than that for sure. You said you sat on a water hole and called called yeah, some bulls so in. How awesome hole. is we that? You can tell where they're coming in. You can see all the tracks and everything and we'll call them in and they got with like 15 yards of them. It's just bugling loud too. Yeah. Like, it almost like hurts your ears how close they were to you. You know, it's yeah. awesome. <laughs> Makes like the hair stand up on you. Oh, uh, dude, it's shit, insane. You know? so I think that's hands down my favorite that's type why of hunting. So much fun. Oh, yeah. Like, the elk. Elk in the rut is like just insane, guys. I mean, I'm sure most of you guys have done it. They're watching this. You know, calling this dude, giant cool. majestic animal that's like screaming at you. Yeah, you know, it's like dude, it's sweet. What's up, pup? It's Smokey. Smokey? Yeah. Hey. Where's your uncle Money at? <laughs> Money. Yeah. <laughs> What's up, dude? And then just throw some shit on there, you know, a little interest. Like, I just talked to that Thomas Gervaisi guy about nothing but fighting. Like, not any fighting on an interview right now. It's just all movie yeah. stuff, but it's just like, man. It's Movies, fashion, music, art, fashion. food, fashion. Oh, you're set, dude. Food. Yeah. Like, after your fight, like, what you're gonna eat? Joe BC you gonna eat? Yeah, I need a blog or something. But video blogs are the way to go, huh? Yeah. YouTube channel? YouTube, bro. It's a good, it's, it's a movie. It's the new way of life. It's the way? Yeah. Yeah. Because like with you, you hunt and then you just show when you're training. Yeah. Like there's still the MMA life. Just kind of makes it all but up. But more, there. I feel like more hunting people are following it than mm -hmm. like MMA people. Right? I'm slowly starting to switch my fan base over. I think that's it. Yeah, I saw a lady the other day that said, oh my God, I didn't even know you're a fighter. I just followed you. Yeah, hunting. exactly. Yeah. That's sick. It's awesome. I love hearing that shit. You got layers, bro. <laughs> yeah. Terrible <laughs> suit. Yeah. Well, Joby, Joby Wan Kenobi. We need to get your YouTube channel started. I know. You really do. You won't. He's scared. Dude, I want to. He's scared. He ain't gonna do it. <laughs> Boopy! Fuck you, Chad. TJ is captain. Yeah. Driving us out. Three and a half hours. Three and a half hours to Craig. Should be pretty smooth drive. Yeah. No traffic. Do we go through the mountains at all? Oh yeah, we go down the 70, which goes up to the mountains. Yeah. Gotcha. So yeah. It, was, it was awesome getting to see Joe. I haven't seen that guy in a long time. Uh, so it was awesome catching up. Had some uh, left, leftover Thanksgiving dinner. It was awesome. But we're on the road. We're going to get after it. We should be there uh, tonight. Hopefully. We don't hit a ton of traffic or anything, but we'll see. Alright, we just made it. To, I think this is Silvertown. Holy crap, it's cold out here. <laughs> I was not ready for that. Uh, we're gonna get some diesel real quick, just a little pit stop. I'm gonna run in. I gotta pee and I'm hungry as usual. So I'm gonna. Oh, holy crap, I didn't grab my jacket. It's got snow on the ground. I'm not used to that, living in Sacramento. <laughs> Let's go get a snack. So we're kind of in a hurry, not trying to stop and eat. I'm always, this is always a, a gamble, trying to eat a, a gas station sandwich. <laughs> sometimes you win, sometimes you lose. I'm gonna, I'm gonna see what happens today. <laughs> it's cold! I think that's lying, I think it's colder than I need <laughs> yeah, to do. I think so too, it felt like it was about 10 I'm outside. Eating, I'm eating my butt, so I'll get some butt butt soon, boys. <laughs> Yeah, I'm, I'm actually gambling on this uh, gas station 
oh, sandwich. Awesome. So you might be in trouble tonight. Are we sharing a room? I think so. <laughs> you might be in trouble later. We'll see. <laughs> we got one twin size bed. Icy spots. Gosh. Too cold. We just made it to Craig, Colorado. We're uh, gonna head over to um, the Outfitter's dad's house. He lives here, has an insane trophy room, I guess. So we're gonna meet him here, just see what's up and check this place out. It's colder than a witch's titty out here. Snow. <laughs> what is that? What is that stuff? No. <laughs> I think we should knock on the front door. Yeah, let's go check it out. Did you uh, text him? Yeah, I texted him. <laughs> sure this is the right place bro? Hopefully. <laughs> Breaking the little turn. Hopefully the doorbell works. That wouldn't be good. I want to check all this stuff out. Dude, look at this room. Holy crap, dude. This is amazing, dude. I need one of these. This is like the ultimate man cave. It doesn't get better than that. That is the first bug that you killed in this wow. one, right? Yeah, that one right there. That's right. Which buck? Which which one was your first buck? Uh, one right there. Yeah. The first buck you ever killed. Second grade. Second grade. Second grade? Yeah. Wow. Yeah. It's a perks of living in Colorado, huh? Heck yeah. Is that where? Dude, this is unreal. You got a good one. Yeah, that's cool. Yeah. Grizz? That was a brown bear, man. They went to Russia and had. Oh no way. Look at the double droppers. Look at this. Unbelievable. How big was that moose? I don't know what that was. Big enough. Yeah. <laughs> That's pretty good. Dude, this is awesome. Yeah, this deer is crazy. Are any of these bad boys yours? Oh, those are all my dad's. Man, that is a dream hunt for me. Yeah, I'm going to try to get a stone sheep hunt this year. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Mm. Dude, yeah, this the, is the awesome. The animals, yeah, this year were nice, dude. That's an odd ad? so nice. Yeah. How big was that? Holy. He shot that up at the Hearst Castle in uh, California. What? Yeah. I didn't even know they had odd ad there. We had a, um, a cook. Dude, that thing is a monster. Out there. Holy crap. Man, this is awesome. I definitely need one of these at home. Yeah. Abby, it's happening. <laughs> <laughs> I know, that's all I did. <laughs> All right, man, we'll see you tomorrow. See ya. All right, dude. All right, headed to the hotel. Hotel, motel, holiday inn. Say what? All right, we decided to take a little pit stop for dinner. Subway, eat fresh, if it's even open. You want a diet, son? TJ's in camp right now. We're gonna make sure he gets his- I'm Trying to be lean and mean. His nutrients. I'm on that Jared diet. <laughs> Not the little boys. No cookies for you, though. Oh, man. All right, they're open. Hello. We're about to grab. What is this? You guys got ice cream too? Oh no! What? I've never seen this before in a subway. It's not right. It's not right. What's your go-to sandwich, Dilla Shank? I think I'm a sweet onion chicken teriyaki kind of guy. What? You know. Well, sauces, oh, yeah. not all the sauces, not the fatty. <laughs> it's awesome. It's the healthier route, I guess. Yeah, it's pretty healthy, I guess so. I went or straight bacon. The, the <laughs> meatball foot long. You won't. Bulk up a little bit. <laughs> it's not bulking season for you. It's true. It's not. It's leaning out. You're, sl you're slim season. Yeah, I'm just a tiny boy right now. I love these things. All right, we made it. The old Clarion. Me and old Killer Shaw. About to go edit this video. I'm gonna teach him the ways. He might have to start his YouTube channel. What do you guys think about it? I need, I need this in my life. <laughs> yeah. I need to express my feelings. I have a lot to say all the time. <laughs> no one to listen to him. <laughs> my wife hates those uh, <laughs> We'll get TJ on there. We're gonna get that set up. But we gotta get all our stuff. We're gonna head in, guys. That's how you know you're in a hotel in Colorado, not California. <laughs> you walk in and there's deer and elk mounts everywhere. That's pretty awesome. You got a Bear, moose, <laughs> sorry. You're good. All right guys, we just made it to our room. We're officially here. 
We're gonna get all settled. I'm gonna start editing this video for you guys. We're gonna do a semi-live, so I'm gonna do one of these every day. So it's really just gonna be tonight, tomorrow, and then Sunday, our travel back. Look how disappointed man. We have two beds. I thought we were sharing a bed. No. This is bull. We told them we wanted one bed. <laughs> Only one. Big spoon, little spoon. You didn't understand. Disappointing. But, all right, guys. I'm gonna start editing this sucker and get it up for you guys. Uh, well, I'm. it'll be up tomorrow morning, so you guys will see this first thing. But we'll see you guys tomorrow. We're uh, getting up at 5, probably about 5, 445. We're heading out of here about 530, so... Um, we've got a, got about a 45 minute check to where we're going to be hunting and uh, hopefully there's elk everywhere so we'll see. Stay tuned guys. <laughs>